It's cause, I think it's because of that summit spot, man. And no. and, and and the uh the qualifier. I'm, I'm all about this. Alright, it seems like we're starting up. PS2. Johnny? I thought Johnny changed his tag. He's still in Smash.gg as Johnny, so I don't think he got around to changing it there yet. But uh, uh he, he I think was he always just, just out Johnny. The Fortnite. Nah, he was always just Johnny. Johnny Fortnite was his Twitter at. Okay. Um, but yes, so this should be a good set. I love watching. I'm a huge Johnny fan, honestly. I love watching Johnny play. I don't know what it is. I, th I just like watching like really quick sortie players, and I don't know. I just like watching good sortie players in general. And Spargo's hella good too, so it should be a good set. Starting off with Krom, though. I wonder. I, I figured if you play this many characters, like Johnny plays four characters at like a very good level. Uh, you have to have your matchups figured out, or I don't know if he's yeah. based on matchup feel or player feel. Uh, definitely a bit of both, because at a certain point you get, you start to figure out the matchup to a good enough sense where you won't get hit by the cheese and you got your spacing down. Oh, yeah. And then after that is like just player feel, you got to know the play styles of those characters. I think a good thing about picking Krom in this matchup too is that you know, he's hella solid, he's got a lot of consistency in terms of his punish game. He's also super fast and can keep up with uh, Cloud's blinding speed as well. I feel like this was definitely a good character pick to go for it. Honestly, I feel like all of Johnny's characters would do well, even Ike. And we're seeing that there, great fair, not afraid to edge guard. You know, that, that's what yeah, you have one, to do with Krom, yeah. But super low. Like limbo champion though. Oh, yeah. oh Hermes. <laughs> limbo champion. <laughs> Can you go down low? <laughs> Can you bring it to the floor? Spargo looking clean though, so far. Yeah, but, not really giving but, him too but, much. Look, look at Johnny just bringing it back. No jump on Spargo. And still applying the pressure. Woo! And that was Freeze. not stock, but that that's scared that's scared of Spargo. That was a great tech chase right there by Johnny. Spargo is sliding f tilt though, just finding his way in. I, I like the fact that Spargo is not jumping like a hell of a lot. I feel like jumping right in Krom's face is just asking for it. So he's trying to use like Crown's, uh, Cloud's uh, grounded options like sliding f tilt. Yeah. No dash attack yet though. Maybe that's just not as good. Tight set so far though, honestly. Like yeah. I know we're only game so, one, but like I feel like this isn't undoable for either player right now. Yeah. Go back and forth if that goes on. Alright, hitting him out of the uh with up B right there. Yeah, Spargo just punishing all these bad uh on shield options right here. You know, climb hazard being one of the best out of shield options in the entire game. But Johnny taking that stock off and only at 64 right now, you know? He, he's he's got a lot of longevity still left in him. Great patience on the ledge, but yeah. If you can find the more random option or a combo oh, yeah. starter. That's the thing, you gotta be careful when playing like very fundamentally based characters like Krom who are just based on like solid stuff like punish game. Like don't have too much cheese. Like I know Uppy's a little bit cheese. Yeah. But um You have to be careful that you're not falling into a pattern. And uh very ill advised Uppy right there is gonna send Johnny down game one. Spargo with the Tiger Woods PGA golf PGA tour golf swing, taking off that game one. Yeah. <laughs> Tiger uppercut. <laughs> Tiger. <laughs> Close tight game one though, honestly. Spargo though, I, I feel like Spargo's just more confident right now though. That's that's what I'm seeing through his gameplay. He's just he knows what he has to do. He's not jumping like crazy. He's not really opening himself up for Johnny to get those fat punishes on him. He's playing some solid nutri right now. Yeah, no, he's definitely feeling. He's feeling himself enough, just probably needs to clean up in like some places. Absolutely. But yeah. that, he already gives Spargo a run for his money. For sure. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, Johnny's probably older. Spargo's like in the second grade. They're both young. I think both of these guys are very young. I don't know. Spargo's still in the uterus, man. Spargo's, like, yeah, Spargo's very young. Keep um, just decreasing his age. <laughs> I th yeah, both these players are hella young, though, I'm pretty sure. And very talented, yeah. at the, you know. I, I, I always, I don't, especially in this Wi-Fi era. Honestly, being young means nothing. You're a kid. You have all the time in the world to game it up. You just have high school and school to worry about. You don't have any. Yeah, maybe sports. I think being young is cheating. Being young is absolutely cheating if you're trying to be good in esports. That's your prime right there. Let's make an age bracket. Twenty-two. You don't have to work for a living. You don't have any of that stuff. Your prodigy, cool. Show, show me someone's forty-five-year-old uncle. 
go on beast mode in bracket, and then I'll be impressed. Yeah. That's a prodigy. <laughs> <laughs> That's a prodigy right there to me. All right, switching to Ike. I'd say, honestly, all of Johnny's characters are solid. This has got to be his best one, though, for sure. I feel like this is just the one he's put the most time into. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think that's also to be the case. But I can understand the difficulties of playing this matchup. Oh my god, almost stealing that stock off the bat. Johnny's taking no prisoners right now, yeah. Yeah, he's like, yo, I heard you talking shit. One thing Spar uh, Spargo has to watch out for against Johnny is the punish game. I feel like Johnny's punish game on this character is a lot less open-ended. You know, with Krom, you kind of have to be a little bit more freeform, but with Ike, you do, you do your job. You have your follow-ups, you have your confirms. Still, though, Spargo just knows the anti ike attack. He's doing a great job just walling out Johnny using these uh, blade beams right now to stuff out Spargo. Spargo's got to be careful on his DI on these upbeats, man. I I'm afraid he's going to get sucked into the abyss. You know, it's not looking good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, though, we're reset to nuke. Both these characters pretty much at kill percent right now. Yeah, the back is not going to take it right there. Really good edge guard yeah. by Johnny right now. Uh, and uh, you don't see a lot of Ikes go for that? Definitely not. Cloud is, I feel like, the perfect character to go on, because he's only recovering one way, usually. Yeah. So, like, characters that like to go low like that, and just cut off their resources, I think it's just a great yep. cut off. Forced out the air dodge right there, I feel like Johnny could have just drifted forward and done up B. I know Ike's aerial drift ain't the best after, after getting hit, but I feel like air dodge was, was too risky of a play, especially at the height he was at. Click so? Yeah, I think Blade Beam hits so high and is so big that I can really pick I got a quick draw wherever he is when coming back to stage. Uh, you have to like either space it perfectly right below the Blade Beam or just like pray. <laughs> <laughs> Going right through that, still Spargo saving his jump. And and really good up B right there. Spargo's recovery, yeah. Recovery master with this character. He ain't number one on Wi-Fi for three. That's true. You right. All right, though, the up tilt. Both these guys c stubbornly clinging onto their lives here. All right. Johnny up for the first time this set, like, super solidly. Yeah, and it, uh, often the ill-advised dash attack. Ooh, he's trying to end it all. Dude. Holy moly. Oh, yeah. that's bad. This is bad for Johnny. I don't think he's got to jump. Yeah, yeah no, that's it. 54%. This is one good string. This is looking so scary for both of these guys right now. This this will put one of these players in losers. There is no being floated out of pools here. You, ha you will have to play another set if you lose. All right. Yeah, no, you're right. And Spargo. Yeah, you're right. And Spargo, Spargo is looking like Smash 4 Cloud. He's turning up. He's turning up with these bears. Johnny, Johnny can't get a punish anymore. Spargo turning up. You know, people they say people play their best or their worst on their last stock, and I think Spargo's a case for best. Definitely a former. Mm -hmm. This is tough. Johnny getting scared now, dude. Spargo's been testing his chops so much with the swinging and the conditioning is beautiful. He was able to get a grab really, really nicely because Johnny was just forced to shield there. And the parry off of that too. Yo, Spargo's not dropping anything right now. That was is that it? What yeah, happened that, that last stock, man? Spargo turned up. Yo, Jesus. It's called the Spark Goat. Spark Goat for, for a reason, baby. The Spark Goat. And the Perry off the field, too. Spark Goat. Michael Jordan. Then the Spark Goat. That was brutal. Is that it? What <laughs> happened that last stock, of pools, man? Really Spargo cleanly turned. right there, might I add. Johnny going down to face Kofi. So he's going to have to fight another sortie to potentially make it out. Yeah. Um... And yeah, guys, that will be it for us today here at Collision Online. We're going to be swapping.